Carcassonne was released in the year 2000 and today we'll take a look at the 20th anniversary of this very popular board game. This anniversary edition comes with high gloss UV spot printed tiles along with the box itself. Also, this edition brings 20 new tiles including more river tiles, abbots, and meeple stickers to personalize your meeples. This box also includes the 72 tiles from the original base game with new illustrations. Later on in the video, we'll take a look at the 15 new tiles that are included in this anniversary edition, including how the stickers look on the meeples themselves. Thanks so much for watching this video and supporting the channel. Now let's get on to the unboxing. So, this box is very nice. It's very um, elegant. That's a good word to, I could use to describe it. It has, it's blue and it has these markings. I'm not sure what kind of print this is called, but you can tell that it's glossy. It has this nice little crest shield. The lettering is gold and it shines. It's very very nice attention to detail. The little meeple here. It's a heavy box. Also the sides have the same kind of lettering. Very elegant I would call it. Or very appropriate for the 20th uh, anniversary. Same at the bottom. And then in the back we have this beautiful layout of the actual board itself. You can see some of the maybe some of the design changes there on some of the some of the tiles. Very nice, very nice attention to detail on the on the box. All right, so let's unbox this uh, this game here. All right. So here we get greeted with the uh, instruction manual and the contents for the game. It has this nice little uh, design that kind of invokes a feel of like being worn down. Um, and if you look at some of the the way it's laid out here, it's very interesting, very nice. have here a supplemental rule sheet. It says after playing a few games of Carcassonne you could add these additional rules for new options and, st and strategies. This rule sheet covers the farmers, the river, the abbot, and the anniversary expansion with an explanation of the new tiles. have uh, some of the decals that you can put onto some of the meeples. Check that out, some of the artwork there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Glossy, glossy decals. And then here are some of the tiles. I don't know if you can see there, you probably see it, but the tiles are glossy. The river is uh, glossy, you can see some of the shine there. Let me get up close here on some of the tiles. Pretty nice, pretty good looking tiles. Flag is glossy. See the 20 year little detail there. Here's some of the cities, 
with the borders. You can see some of the detail here of, uh, looks like a group of people right there in the corner. I'm not sure if you can see it, but you can see the little 20 on the banner there. Some woolly mammoth, all right. See the chariot there with 20. Pretty nice, nice attention to detail on the on the tiles. And you have this big tile here that I'm noticing with 20 on it. It's pretty nice. Then we have here the um, <clears throat> tilt it over. Also with some glossy areas. Pretty nice. And down here is where you can put all your components. We got some of the uh, other meeples here. Let's open this up. So we have this big bag here, um, full of all the meeples. And then on the insert, on the inside you can see the same design goes into the box here. Well, this is a nice looking game of Carcassonne. Uh, now let's uh, take a look at the way it looks on the actual table. Right, but some of these meeples, let's just take a look at them real quick. Um, they're your standard wooden pieces. Uh, this one looks like it's broken. Look at his head, that shaved off. Those are the standard meeples. Um, and then the other meeples. So these are a little bit different. At first glance, they look like little guitars um, but when I was looking at the sticker sheet you can see that uh, those meeples belong to those right there and then these other meeples or these other stickers fit on the standard meeples and as you can see here we have a uh, front and a back. So if you decide to put these stickers on a meeple, you can have the front and back. And I'll show you that right now. Alright, we'll take this one off first. So as you can see, they're clear. And we'll use the one that's defective, the head cut off. I just lost it. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'll cut while I go find the sticker that just flew. So, while applying this decal, I accidentally mm, touched the corner and these decals are not flimsy, they're kind of strong little plastic. personality to the game itself. You can have little unique pieces on the board. Here's a close-up of the 15 new tiles included in this edition. Each tile has a special ability that can be done in the game. 
the double tile is also a special tile for this edition. I think that this version of Carcassonne was produced very well. It has nice looking pieces, the tiles look nice, and I like the fact that they added more things to the 20th anniversary edition. Thanks for watching this video, and if you want to see more content like this, please visit the channel. There are a lot more unboxings on there. Thanks for watching.